Yo, what's going on boys? Today I'm going to be playing some 2.6 hog cycle on top ladder. So if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I'm in my first match here. I'm going to hog ice bear first play. You guys probably already know this, but hog 2.6 is one of the most hated decks on Clash Royale. And it's because of how fast you can cycle through hogs and how annoying the deck is on defense. But right now the meta is kind of bad for it. A lot of minor poison and tornado decks with evil archers. So hog 2.6 is not in a good place right now. Um, also just checked if there's anyone in the top 100 with Hawk 2.6 and I found out that there's nobody in the top 100 with it So I'm gonna try to win games in the top 100. I'm like top 70 right now. So Yeah, first game with hog. Let's see if I can win it facing Mega Knight right now though And this guy's also really good with Mega Knight. He's like one of the best Turkish players. So gonna be tough gonna musketeer in the back Okay, I'm gonna try to go for like a Ice spirit in the back or something. He goes for the ice spirits. So I'm gonna or goes for the minor zaps I'm gonna log right now Okay, good defense right here. Good pop as well to take out my musketeer. I'm going to go for an ice golem on the big guy. That way the archer and the big guy also die. The ice golem death bomb will take out the 1 HP archer. So I'm going to hog on the right lane right now to bait out the mega knight. If I do bait it out, then I'm probably going to try and get away with like a really cheap defense by activating my king tower. Or I'll try to kite that away. But he did go for a wall breaker, so he was able to mini peck on it. I'm going to ice spear on the mini peka, take it out. I'm back to my evo skellies, but I have to kind of make good use of them though. Good thing is that he only has one small spell and it's a uh, zap. He doesn't have a bar barrel because I think he has minions and a uh, little prince. So I should be able to do something with this, but kind of have to watch out. I have to put them to good use. I'm going to go for skellies in the back here. And then I'm just going to try and go for ice golem on the left here to tank for the skellies. And then I'll go hog on the right. He can't defend both. There's actually no way that he defends both here. Wait, the skellies on the left. Yo, look at the skellies on the left. Yo. Oh my god, wait, he has zapped though. He's probably gonna zap. That's a lot of damage. Yo, he missed. Wait, please. No, they didn't multiply. No, I don't know why they didn't multiply. I mean, one of them was on the tower, but I'll take the damage. That's a lot of damage. I'll take that for sure. <laughs> that was kind of funny though. Just like off of like half an elixir, he got punished for like 1500 damage. I say half an elixir because I split them in the back and then only two of them went on the left. But just gonna musketeer on the left here. Gonna skelly's high. Okay. Little Prince in the back. I can't really hog into the left lane right now because he has a Mega Knight. So I'm going to Fireball Log on the right to take out the Little Prince. I don't want him to pop the ability and get the big guy. So I would rather just kind of overspend on it and then take it out. Evil Archers. Okay, super annoying. I feel like this matchup is mine, but it's so annoying with the Evil Archers. Like it's going to take everything for me to win this game. I'm going to Fireball. Make sure to hit the Evil Archer. going to Ice Spirit. Then I'm going to Skellies over here. Activate my King. Yes. Okay, got the King activation. So looking good. Archers in the middle to take out my Evo Skellies, not too bad. I'm going to try to go for a Muskie in the back here. He might try to Miner here, so I wanted to Muskie in the back to make sure that I wouldn't take any damage off of it. I'm going to Hog on the right. Good thing I predicted something in the back. I thought he was going to Mega Knight, but I got the Mini P.E.K.K.A. in the back, so it's fine. I'm going to Fireball Log here to take out the little guy and then also get damage on the Mega Knight. going to Skellies in the middle, going to Cannon, going to Ice Golem so he can't Wall Breakers into it because my Cannon should take it out. I think I have to musketeer on defense too. Those minions are going to be annoying. Okay, good defense right here. I'm going to hog on the left. I don't want to go same lane because he could just stack up like a big push. So I want to kind of split his push. I'm going to bait out the mini pack on the left here. Pretty positive that he won't be able to Mega Knight on time. I'm going to log on the right to take out the little guy. Okay. Can in the middle. Oh, I keep putting it one tile low. I feel like I have to fireball that now. If I put that one tile high, he would not be able to wall breakers. But I keep messing it up though. So again, next time, I'm going to make sure to play it high or like to the right lane. I'm going to go for a musky in the back on the right lane. Played minions in the back. I was about to hog, but can't do it into the minions. I'm going to log right now. Ice spear on the left lane. And then I'm just going to try to go for an ice golem down low. Fireball on the mini P.E.K.K. Okay, got the Mega Knight too, so that was a pretty good fireball. I'm going to musky in the back. I'm going to log on the right to take out the little guy. Okay, evil archers are going to be super duper annoying, but... I think I should be able to defend if I play this well though. I'm going to evo skellies right now. Yo, he zapped. Wait, um, Skelly should do something, hopefully. No? No, okay. This is definitely not good. I took so much damage right there because my Evo Skellies just decided to die and then let the Mega Knight jump on my tower too. And the Evo Archer locked on my stuff. I'm going to log and try to make the Mega Knight jump. I know it's going to Mega Knight, so I'm going to hog into it. Okay, let's go for the Mega Knight. I'm going to Ice Golem right now and then go for Ice Spirit. Just going to Cannon High to take out the Archer. Log right now. Good Zap, but not going to do much. Ice Spirit. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, Cannon. <sighs> okay, I thought one of them were going to make it, but good defense. I'm going to Fireball on the tower to seal the deal. He's probably going to zap, but should not be enough to get any damage on my tower, so I'll take the win. 
All right, that game got close. On second thought, I'm not even sure if that's my matchup because evil archers are so annoying. I feel like if you get one good set of evil archers down, then you kind of just win the game with the Mega Knight deck. But I'll take the win though. That game is going to put me at top 67. I'm just going to hop right in. Okay, I'm in my next match here. Oh my god, I keep facing Mega Knight today. This guy's also a Mega Knight player, so he's probably playing the Evil Archers deck with the Ghost and Mini P.E.K.K.A. and all that stuff. Oh, he has a Ram Rider. Okay, so no Mini P.E.K.K.A., but he still has like the Poison Evil Archers kind of deck, so kind of have to watch out. I'm going to log and then go Skelly's here to not let the Bandit go too crazy on my tower. Okay, that wasn't too bad, actually. Could have been better, but my Ice Spear and my Cannon were nowhere to be seen, so... I just had to kind of compromise and go for like a musketeer log on defense. I'm going to hog again. Yeah, I feel like if I hog again, I might be able to bait out the Mega Knight. So I might potentially be able to activate King Tower off like the Mega Knight or the Bandit. I feel like he might also play Bandit with the Mega Knight. So I'm going to have to kind of watch out on defense here. But I'll try my best to activate the King Tower and also not take any damage. Man, this matchup is kind of annoying though compared to the Mini P.E.K.K.A. deck. Because Ram Rider defends my hog and like kind of applies more pressure on top of that. So... Gonna have to definitely watch out with the bandit might activate my king tower. I spare pull it to the king tower, hit the king tower now. Nice. Oh my god, wait, it actually did not activate. It died before activating the king tower. That's so annoying. I have to focus extra hard on defense now. King tower would have been so easy, but now I kind of have to just focus. I don't know why he did that actually. Should have saved the ram rider, but he played it at the bridge. That should die to my cannon. I'm going to go for the Evo Skellies on the Ghost. I know that he has a Bar Barrel in hand right now, so I'm going to let those die for now. Because I kind of had to defend, but I'll be smarter with the Evo Skellies next time, though. I'm going to Hog right now to bait out the Mega Knight. Should be able to bait it out. Oh, what? Little Prince. All right, well, that's kind of bad because the Knockback got a nerf. So, like, he actually is not able to defend the Hog without taking any damage. I'm going to Musketeer on defense right now. Should take out both, but he might try to go Poison on this, though. Yeah, I'll let that slide. I'll let him poison that. I'm going to log right now. Wait, how did that lock on my tower? Oh, annoying. I didn't think he was going to lock on my tower. I was hoping it would lock on the musketeer because that was a dead musket anyways. I was going to like let it lock on the musket and go crazy, but should not matter though. I'm going to musket in the middle. Second musket down and he's still like two cards off poison. So I'm going to try to go for a hog rider on the right lane. I'm going to log on the Mega Knight and the Ghost and they should kind of take some damage from the musketeer. At least the Mega Knight, not the Ghost. But yeah, he might try to bandit here though. So I'm going to ice skull him high to make the bandit walk and then just going to ice spirit. Okay, that was good. Going to try to log on the left here on defense and also hit the evo skellies while I'm at it. So they don't do like a lot of damage or take on my musketeer. I'm going to skellies here and then go ice skull him for the two ghost. Okay, that one evo archer is putting in that work. Oh my god, got three hits on my tower. But I'm going to musky and then just going to ice spirit. Okay, not too bad. Going to log right now and then go evo skellies on this thing. And then I'll just go for like a hog rider right now. Should not be able to Mega Knight because I think he has to Bar Barrel, so I'm just going to Fireball on the tower. Okay, that's like one Fireball. Yeah, that's just one Fireball on the tower, so I'm just going to try to get it back. Log to take out the Bandit, push the little guy off, and then also take out the Ram Rider, so I'm going to be one off Fireball. Just going to Ice Skull him and then go Fireball. Pretty nice and solid win. Um, This guy kind of played horrible. Like His Ram Riders were really bad. The only two times that he played it on defense was both late, so I got the win. Okay, I'm in my next match here, facing Regalese Naranja. See what deck he's playing. I'm gonna hog on the right to cycle. I don't wanna ice skull him hog. I mean, he could have a tornado, but I don't like to go that aggressive. Although with 2.6, I probably should be doing it. Like right here, if I did it, I would have been paid off because he would not be able to tornado. So he would have to play like a building in the middle, but I think I'll still be able to win though. Archers and a tornado means E Giant, so it's not that bad. I just have to be really careful with the cannon. I'm going to log on the right, but yeah, I just have to be careful because I know that he is a lightning and a little guy. So he can either snap out my cannon or try to go for a lightning on it. So if I be super careful about it, I think I'll be okay. Good ice spirit on the bowler, taking the whole bowler out. I'm going to fireball on the little guy and then the musketeer should be able to take it out as well. Okay, that was good. Oh, he popped the ability on time. Though. He actually managed to get it down on time. So I'm going to go skellies right now and then try to bait out like a bar barrel. See if I can. Does go for the bar barrel. So I'm going to ice skull. I'm just going to hog right now. I feel like kind of an overcommit, but this should pay off though. Yeah, because no tornado and cycle barely. So I was able to log on the tombstone and get one shot on the tower. Maybe even get like a second shot. Nah, never mind. If that was Ian's hog, then yeah, it would get the second shot because it's super broken and busted. But my hogs are not broken, so it did not get the second shot. I'm kind of happy with the one shot though. I'll take that for sure. Goodness, Skelly's in the back split here. Actually, 
I'll go Muskie in the back. I don't want to Skellies in the back yet. Those are Evo, so I kind of have to watch out. Okay, I could go Ice Golem Hog, but I'm going to Ice Golem on the left here, all the way up high, and then try to go for a Hog Rider with this on the left lane. I feel like I have to pressure to not let him go for, like, a e giant. So I'm going to Hog right now. Whoa, what is my Hog doing? It got stalled out at the bridge. Okay, he had to Tornado that, though. I'll take that for sure. I'm going to Evo Skellies on the Buller. Don't really have, like, a second choice. I'm going to go for an Ice Spear, and then I'm going to kind of wait for the Archers to take them out. Okay, Evo Archers, I actually cannot take them out on time, but... I'll Fireball the right side, though, just to get the damage. Okay, he might E-Giant on the left. I'm going to Hog right now, and then I'm going to have to let the Evo Archer connect. That way I can defend the E-Giant, because if that locks on my cannon, my cannon gets four-tapped. Wait, what? Wait, what just happened? Wait, how did my stuff, like, manage to retarget the Evo Archer? No, that's so unfortunate. The E-Giant's going to do, like, a thousand damage on my tower now. Oh my god, that's actually so annoying, but I still should be able to come back. Though. I'm not down a lot, only 700 damage. That's like two hog hits or like a few fireballs, but he's also going to be spelling me back with the lightning at the same time, so I'm going to have to watch out. I'm going to hog, going to fireball on the tower and the tombstone, hopefully. Oh, I got it. Okay, hog's going to get the one shot. He might try to E-Giant here, but I'm going to Evo Skellies on it. Yeah, wait, he's going to tornado on the Evo Skellies. I'm going to predict it right now. Go hog opposite. Going to cannon high now. Oh my god, such a good prediction. The hog's going to get like two hits on the tower. No, only one shot for that, really. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, my hogs are mad weak. I feel like Ian's hogs would have ended the game already, but it's fine though. I'm going to try to go for a fireball on the bowler. Should not matter. I mean, I can cycle back to like a second fireball in no time. So this shouldn't really do much. Like should not make a big of a difference. Okay, does go for a little prince, but I'm going to play my cannon on the anti-lightning from the left. I don't want him to lightning my stuff and just get damaged with it. Although he might be able to lightning that though. I'm going to scale his high. Okay, gonna Ice Spirit. Ice Golem to tank for it too, because that's not gonna die anytime soon. Barbara got locked on, so I'm gonna have to Muskie here. I was trying to hog opposite lane, but had to Muskie on defense. All good though. I'm gonna hog right now. Ah, uh, actually, Fireball Log is gonna be the move. If I hogged into that, that would have gotten so much value, so I'm glad that I didn't go through with it. I was able to pull it back to my deck. He's at 7 now, so I'm go Idra. I'm gonna Ice Spirit on the Archer. Okay, gonna cannon down low to take out the e giant. I'm gonna skellies on this archer to not let it do like a lot of damage on my cannon. I'm gonna log on the tombstone. The hog might get one shot, hopefully. Come on. Yes. Okay. 533 or 593. I'm blind. 593 is going to be like two fireballs. And is it two logs or one log? No, it should be one log. So I'm gonna log right now and then try to get back to two fireballs. Okay. Just gonna scale the middle, gonna fireball, and one more fireball should be able to win the game. So, gonna log Ice Spirit, one off fireball, scale back to fireball, I'm gonna fireball on the tower, and that is gonna be a good game. So, I'm actually gonna go ahead and end the video there. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And next video, I'm probably gonna do ladder with a different deck. So, let me know in the comments if you guys want me to play like a specific deck on ladder. But yeah, for now, top 54 with Hog 2.6. So, once again, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe and use code Aragon. Bye.